representing Auckland, New Zealand, fighting out of Tiger Muay Thai, Kai Kara. I've always had a goal the whole time I've been here and that hasn't changed is to make it into UFC. So every morning I always try to do something that gets me one step closer. Yeah, I've always had this hunger and drive this whole time I've been in Thailand. Skill set, we might be the same, but um, I'm, w I'm willing to die for it. So that's what gives me the extra. well-rounded and always coming in shape so I'm always pushing my cardio always uh, being in top conditioning let's get on a boat I don't know how they're gonna let a bunch of hooligans on there but I guess there's supposed to be some MMA fights so we're gonna go no, that's the <laughs> <laughs> First time ever in history, uh, MMA fight held on international waters. You've got to realise you're there for one reason and you're there to fight. So you can't be overwhelmed by being on a cruise ship. You just have to always remember, I'm there for business. Buy me a beer if you knock him out. Okay, I'm definitely buying a beer there. Well, I can't it. <laughs> when I walk into the cage, I feel excited to put on a show. Why I fight? I love to compete, to push myself to the limits. I put a lot of work into what I do. So you would say I look for perfection, so when I step in the ring, I know I've put in the work and I've, I've put in the hours, so that's why I like to enjoy the moment and live in the present and just enjoy every moment while I'm in there because that's why we do it.
Once again, Kai Kara France dominating performance. He's back at the right weight class. We know Kai stuff will take any fight, doesn't matter who he fights. And uh, he's got great coaches, great training partners. His, uh, his career is taking a turn now. Ah, we're good. Good to go. Get another one going. Me? No, you're gonna take like two weeks off and not. No, I'll go pee pee now and have a rest. <laughs> go to pee pee for like a week. But remember, don't blink. This one.